I'm doing this video real quick. I was just playing with the dogs and they're barking downstairs. But I was gonna do the breakdown for my Target haul and my Walgreens hauls real quick. Um, so this was a curbside pickup for Walgreens. Um, basically you grab this Aller Life for $7.99. There's a $4 off digital coupon making it $3.99. After tax, mine was $4.27. I redeemed $4 in Walgreens cash, paid $0.27 cents out of pocket. But I submitted my receipt my receipt to Shopkick and got a 1,000 kicks back, which is basically, I think, $4. So um, makes this allergy medicine free. But what I will say is I did this deal this morning and it already reset on my app, so I'm going to do the deal again. Um, I'm gonna try to keep doing the deal as much as I can um, before it expires. So free allergy medicine. Also, throughout my deals, I picked up my poise because this deal ends on the 27th. It's been going on for the past two or three weeks. Poise are on sale, two for $9. They are $2 off paper coupons. So if you get two of them for a total of $9, use a $2 off coupon, $2 off coupon brings it down to five dollars you can pay that you can redeem walgreens cash whatever but um you will get a five dollar register reward essentially sorry making these free in a way so i definitely sprinkled a bunch of these into my transactions because these are my like number one sellers um target my target deal I posted TikTok about it, but I definitely did not go in depth because you only get a minute to talk. So what I did is I wanted to do a scenario where it's, I had this thing on my cartwheel that said, when you spend $40, you get a $10 Target gift card um, for like beauty and stuff. So what I did was I picked up two of these Axe deodorants. They were $3.99. I picked up two of these Axe sprays, which were $5.69. I had coupons paper coupons for buy one axe product get an axe spray free so when i bought the deodorant for 3.99 i'd be getting the spray for free um so i got that some more things that i got to hit that 40 dollars threshold were these simple face wipes i grabbed four of these at four dollars and 59 cents because i had to buy one get one free um, so basically, oh, one more thing. Picked up this Crest toothpaste for $6.99. I had a $3 off digital coupon on the cartwheel and $3 on Ibotta. So that gave me like a retail total of over $40, maybe like $45, I think. So you want to make sure you hit that retail cost before you apply any coupons. Scan your Target cartwheel app and make sure you have that um, offer, whatever. Um, attached or on your account. So I scanned my cartwheel. The $3 cartwheel came off for this and then I scanned my two Axe coupons and my two Simple coupons and it brought my total down to $26.99. I got back that $10 gift card from the spend 40 get $10 which then brought it down to $17 but and I bought a, I got $3 back for buying the Crest and a dollar for each of these simple limit three so I got an additional six dollars so it went from spending seventeen dollars minus the six dollars to spending eleven dollars for four simple face wipe things two axe deodorants two axe sprays a crest toothpaste and then I had to pick up some flowers uh, flour for making cookies and you can hear my Taylor Swift music in the background because we're jamming um but yeah, that was a really good deal. So I ended up getting 10 items for roughly $11. But essentially, I got this for free because the overage I made from my other shopping trips kind of like balanced this out. And I will explain why in a second. So that was my Target deal. Let me put this away. So then I did, that's a poise. Was this my next one that I did? Yes. This is the one somebody commented on. This was my first Walgreens haul. Um, so basically I had a paper booster for, I wanna say it was get $8 in Walgreens cash when you spend $35 or more. So I went into Walgreens with the mindset, okay, I need to get at least $35 
retail product. But I also had some digital boosters on my account that I was like hoping they would like stack and stuff. And um, I, I think one did, but I, I think the other one didn't because I had two of them. So went into Walgreens with the mindset of, okay, I need to get $35 at least. So picked up some poise to help me get to that retail cost. I picked up two of these simple facial cleansers. These were six, seven ninety nine, and then I picked up two of these wipes for six twenty nine because I had the buy one get one free. I had two more buy one get one free coupons, so that me that got me up there pretty high to my retail cost. And then I wanted to do this deal. with this. So these are on a sale, two for $11, two for 11, two for 11. There's a coupon and then they're also on a sale um, when you buy three participating products, you get $5 Walgreens cash. So I was trying to stack all these crazy sales. Um, yeah, so on my app, I had $8 off of four and you can mix and match. So I mixed two Old Spice with two Secret because there's an Ibotta rebate for these. Um, I don't think there is for these. So, my retail cost for the two Old Space, two Secret, two Poise, and four Simple was like 60-ish dollars, I want to say. My coupons came off. I rolled a $5 register reward from my Poise deal. Or not my Poise deal. Another deal I did. I have, I have all these register rewards just sitting in my purse. So that brought my out-of-pocket cost to $30.75. So I paid that on my credit card because my booster was a spend deal, which means I cannot redeem points if I want to get those bonus points. So paid the $30.75 on my credit card. Got back $17.59 in Walgreens points. Um, and then I'm getting back $5.00 for the um, the secret, I'm getting $3 back for the simple, and then another $5 register reward for the poise. So I think um, after you subtract the points and the Ibotta rebates and um, the register rewards, I think I ended up paying 16 cents for all that stuff. Um, maybe even not. I have to double check my points on the Walgreens app because I always forget. But because I think my boosters stacked, I ended up getting it close to free. Um, so yeah, that was my first Walgreens deal. Put this away. And then I did a second Walgreens deal uh, because I wanted to use, ah, since in that transaction I just did, only one of my booster, my digital booster stacked, I had one left over. So, and it was, I wanna say, get $5 Walgreens cash when you spend $25 or more. Side note, not everybody's gonna have these same boosters as I did, so keep that in mind. So I went in with the mentality, okay, I need to get at least $25 worth of retail product so I can get those bonus points. So this is what I did. I picked up four of these Tresemme because they are two for $10 and I had a $5 off two coupon and a $4 off two coupon, but they are also on a sale when you buy three participating products, you get $5 Walgreens cash. Ugh, cash. So I wanted to stack my booster with something that had coupons, but also had something on a sale with bonus points. So you stack all these deals to get amazing, amazing things. So four Tresemmes. Um, I picked up some Schick because this was also part of the promo. When you buy three particip ugh, participating products, you get $5 Walgreens cash. You can mix and match. So that is what I did. $7.99, I had a $4 off digital coupon. And then I picked up four of these Colgate toothpaste because I had $3 off two coupons. And then it was very interesting. I did not know this, but I knew that they were on a sale. When you buy two, you get $4 in Walgreens cash. Um, but they were also on the display for when you buy any three products, you get $5 Walgreens cash. I didn't know. So I think it was like a double dip situation, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, so that is what I did. I grabbed four of these. 
one razor, and four tresemmes for like, oh, I want to say it was like $40, $50 ish after tax. Um, my point booster came off my account, my digital one. My $5 off two tresemme came off. My $4 off two tresemme came off. My $4 off Schick came off and two $3 off two Colgate coupons came off. And then I rolled um, my um, register rewards for my poise deals to lower my out-of-pocket, making my out-of-pocket cost just $18.03 but I got back $18.43 in Walgreens points, making this transaction free. And the reason why I wanted to get the Tresemme was because these were on my Shopkick. Um, when you buy two, I think, you get 1,600 kicks, something like that, um, which somehow equivalates to, I think, six or $7. So I ended up making $7 off of buying the Tresemme, the Colgate, and the razors. But I noticed when I was looking at my points um, at the bottom of my receipt, I don't think I received all the points that I should have for this transaction, um, which is roughly a missing $10 in points. So I was gonna call Walgreens and see if they can fix that. Most of the time, like 99% of the time, they will fix and just add the points to your account. So if that goes through, then that shopping trip and my first shopping trip at Walgreens and my Target haul will be completely free and a money maker. If they don't fix that problem, then I think I ended up paying $5 for all three hauls, which is still a really good deal. But like I'm 99% sure they're going to give me the $10 in Walgreens points for the stuff um, not coming off or like bonus points not coming through stuff like that um not sure why but I have a feeling because this Walgreens that I go to for that deal like I swear that Walgreens like the points never come out for me and the register rewards never print so like <laughs> I already know that Walgreens is just like a hot mess but it was the closest one that I was at at the time so yes and I'm sorry I didn't have all this written out um haven't had time to sit down crazy 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 with school and stuff so hopefully you can play this back to see um how to do the deals and stuff but i do want to mention every walgreens account has slightly different coupons because the more you shop there the more that they cater to what you buy and not all walgreens accounts will have the same boosters i had a five dollar off booster i had an eight dollar off booster i had a four dollar off booster you might have different ones and you might not have any because i have two walgreens accounts one of my account had boosters and one account did not have any. So it's just like a hit or miss and yeah. So happy shopping y'all.